triple e out on here what's going on guys welcome back my wonderful viewers and subscribers all my loyal subscribers stay tuned as always mansion house as usual hashtag mansion house today we're just gonna show you a way how we tie um min uh conductor wires together um in order for it not to lose off or anything like that and actually to use a rope to pull it in instead of using the fishing wire we're gonna use a rope to pull it in instead Guys, whenever time you are doing this, um, whenever time you are putting these main wires, I'm going to show you an easy way how to tie these wires so you don't have any um, loose, any of it loose off or anything like that. This is a proper way. Right here we have all um, semiconductors, but single strand conductors, but we can actually use two just to get a, a, a full grip of it. Right here I'm going to cut off the rest. So, what we're going to do, we're going to show you a proper way of doing it. Now, as you can see guys, I used two single um, conductors out of the seven strand that actually um, came into it. Um, for it to not to have too many to be wrapping, two out of this can do a good job actually. Once you wrap it and give it a little space like that, so you can see it is slim. These are 35 millimeter single wires, so it should be easy, especially through this three inches conduit. It wasn't the actual plan, to be honest. It was actually I was gonna use something like maybe 50 or 70 millimeters, but electrical wires prices are gone sky high. So any electrical company or anything like that who want me to do a ad for them if they're selling electrical items cheap, you can hit me up. Um, hashtag electrical installation. You can find me on Instagram as well. Um, Yes, yeah, so if you want me to promote your uh, your hardware, your company, anything like that about electrical items, well, you can just hit me up. But this is where we're going to do it. So what we're going to do, if you notice, we have the wires right here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to carry it between the last one. Between the last prong right here. Instead. So when I do it like this. Because whenever you pull in these main wires, a lot of time because of um, it not tied properly it can get loose off and then it cause problem you have to go back all over it so best way for it to do is do it like this you don't have any problem that's where you're going from when man so as you notice guys we tie it right here like that but we're not gonna pull it through like that we're gonna use this right here to actually uh, where we have the loop and the rope right here so we're going to use this um, binding wire right here to wrap it. 
So in order for this to feel actually how the rope can feel if the rope is not strong enough because I think it done a lot of work to be honest so hopefully today is not the day that you're gonna feel on it Guys, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna use some tape on it, electrical tape on it to actually have it go through smoothly. Because these edges right here can each and something in the pipe or some coupling or anything like that. So that's how your tie main wires, main conductor wire, um, conductors. Um, carefully this is a proper way to do it for it to don't have any um, loosening or anything like that this is a proper way to do it 